This video is sponsored by Envato Elements. Hi everyone, in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to add a cinematic fade transition in Premiere Pro, as you can see on the screen. So, let's get started. Alright, now we are inside Premiere Pro. As you can see on the program monitor, I have got two different video clips. For the fade transition, we need to apply some Premiere Pro built-in effects between two video clips. That's why. Let's move over to the Effects panel, and then go to the Video Transitions panel. Now, you can see the Dissolve property. Next, let's click on the drop-down menu of the Dissolve property. To add a cinematic fade transition, only two transition effects are needed. We need only Dip to Black effect and the Dip to White effect. The Dip to Black effect in Adobe Premiere Pro is a transition effect that gradually fades the current video or image to black. This effect is commonly used to indicate the end of a scene, segment, or the entire video. On the other hand, the dip to white effect in Adobe Premiere Pro is a visual transition that gradually fades the current video frame to a solid white screen. It's often used to create a dramatic or attention-grabbing ending to a scene or video. Alright, in the next step, let's drag and drop the dip to black effect at the middle position between two video clips. And then, let's select the effect and move over to the Effect Controls panel. From here, we have to set the center alignment. After that, we can increase and decrease the duration of the transition effect. Let's see how it looks now. Alright, it looks great. In the next step, let's remove the dip to black transition effect. And let's move over to the effects panel to apply the dip to white transition effect. Again, let's select the effect and move over to the effect controls panel. From here, we have to set the center alignment. Next, let's increase the duration of the transition effect. Let's see how it looks now. All right, it looks great. In this way, you can easily add a cinematic fades transition inside Premiere Pro. 